Kalash Nath Katju, the 17th of June 1887 to the 17th of February 1968, was a prominent politician of India. He was the governor of Orissa and West Bengal, the chief minister of Madhya Pradesh, the union home minister and the union defence minister. He was also one of India's most prominent lawyers. He was part of some of the most riveting cases of his times, including the famous Aina trials. Dr. Katju joined the freedom struggle against the British rule in India early on and spent several years incarcerated with fellow freedom fighters. Early life Kalash Nath Katju was born in the princely state of Jayora in present-day Madhya Pradesh on 17 June 1887. His family were Kashmiri Pandits who had settled in Jayora. His father Tribuan Nath Katju was a former Dewan of the state. Kalash Nath was educated at the Bar High School in Jayora, when he was sent to Lahore to study at the Rangmahal High School. He passed his matriculation examination from Punjab University the following year before completing his graduation from Foreman Christian College, Lahore, in March 1905. In July that year, he joined the Muir Central College in Allahabad. In September 1907, he received a degree in laws from the Allahabad University, standing second in the province. In 1908, he received a master's degree in history from the same university. He began legal profession that year in Kanpur that year before moving to Allahabad in 1914. He complete his doctorate in law, the LL.D., from Allahabad University in 1919, joining the Allahabad High Court as an advocate in 1921. <laughs> <laughs> Career Katju defended the accused in the Meerut conspiracy case in Allahabad High Court in 1933 and later the military officers accused at the Indian National Army trials at the Red Fort in Delhi. On 17 July 1937, he became the Minister of Law and Justice and Parliamentary Affairs of the United Provinces in the Govind Balab Pants Cabinet. He was elected to the legislature from the constituency of Allahad District Doba. The ministry resigned on 2 November 1939 and soon Katju was imprisoned for 18 months. He was again imprisoned in 1942. He also served in the Constituent Assembly of India. Between 1935 and 1937, he served as the chairman of the Allahabad Municipal Board, and later as Chancellor of Prayag Mahila Vidyapith, Allahabad. Following the independence of India, Katju held many high political positions. Initially he was made the governor of Orissa from 15 August 1947 to 20 June 1948. He became the governor of West Bengal on 21 June 1948 and was in office till 31 October 1951. In 1951 he was elected to the Lok Sabha from the Mansour constituency, joining the cabinet of Jawaharlal Nehru as law minister in 1951. In November 1951 he succeeded C. Rajagopalachari as the country's third home minister. In 1955 he was made the defense minister. He became the chief minister of Madhya Pradesh on 31 January 1957, remaining in office till the 11th of March 1962. He also held the portfolios for general administration, home, publicity, planning and development, coordination and anti-corruption. Personal life Katju and his wife Rup Kishori had five children together, three sons and two daughters. Son Brahma Nath Katju served as Chief Justice of the Allahabad High Court. The eldest son, Shiva Nath, served as a judge at the same court, and also as member of the Uttar Pradesh Legislature. Kalash Nath's grandson, Markandi Katju, served as a judge in the Supreme Court of India. His daughter was married into a Bengali family, and whose daughter, Tulatama Taror, a professor at the New York University, was the first wife of politician and former diplomat Shushi Taror. Katju had recovered from a kidney ailment he had suffered in the summer of 1967. After his condition deteriorated in early February 1968, he died at 7.55 p.m. East at his residence in Allahabad. The last rites were performed by son Shiva Nath on the bank of the Ganges the following day. <laughs> Publications 
Dr. Kalash Nath Katju wrote many books, some of which are the following Experiments in Advocacy, A Colossus in the Courts of Justice The Days I Remember Reminiscences and Experiments in Advocacy He also wrote many articles and delivered many memorable speeches, including the following Some Judges and Lawyers Whom I Knew Speech delivered on 27 November 1966, on the occasion of the Golden Jubilee of the High Court Building. Founder of National Herald He was one of the founders of Associated Journals Limited and one of the seven original subscribers of the Memorandum of Association of the Company which published National Herald and two other newspapers. His shares were usurped by a company formed and closely held by Sonia Gandhi and her son Rahul Gandhi and two others in 2012. There is a legal case of criminal conspiracy in this regard against the mother-son duo in a court of law in Delhi. <laughs> <laughs> 